Warning, this video may contain foul language, crude humor, and is meant for an adult audience. Please be advised. Hello and welcome to another edition of War Journal Toys. I am Jason, your toy vigilante, here to be your forward observer in your toy hunting missions. Let's debrief. So today we are looking at Masters of the Universe, New Eternia Whiplash from the Masterverse series. Um, I wasn't going to pick this, uh, character up until it was on sale, and lo and behold, I was at Target the other day, and it was like 50% off, so 16 bucks. So I was like, yeah, I'll go for it. So, let's, uh, take a look at the packaging first before we get into Dude. So, standard packaging, no big frills. Whiplash, Tail Thrashing Warrior. Get a nice print back here with some artwork of Whiplash and his standard getup, which I prefer. And then the back, you have him in his full armor with his axe and a spear. Um, the torch thing isn't, isn't on here, but I guess they just threw it in. If you guys are interested, I do have uh, reviews on her Merman, Grizzlor, Buzz Off, and Faker from this group, too. Go back in my archive and you can find them. But, so, there's Whiplash. There's this card if you want to pause it and read it. But the new Eternia line, guys are looking pretty good. I'm not going to get everybody... But let's uh, get that out of the, way, the thing. So he showed up looking like this with the armor and stuff. And then you get this nice axe with him with a little bit of battle worn and chipped in the blades. Nice handle. So he comes with that. Comes with this nice spear. That is very similar to the Origins or Vintage version. And then you get this interesting torch, tiki torch, whatever, where it has some flame on it. I guess you could stick that on his hand if you wanted. Um, and then you get the torch, which has some extra painting on the handle, not just one color. You can see in there. Probably be cool if you could get like a little LED light and drop it in there and let this thing glow. Because if you shove it all the way in there, it does go all the flame does go all the way down. But I like to keep it up here because you got to let air in to let the flame breathe, right? So there's that. Um, take a closer look at him with his armor on. I don't care for the armor. It's it's a nice idea, but and it's pretty. They did a they did a nice job uh, painting it. They didn't fuck it up, which is surprising because I'm gonna take the damn stuff off. But you got some battle battle damage here. They went as far as putting each little uh, rivet is silver, which is surprising. They could have done it on the the. The, the wrist brace wrist guards but they didn't do it but they did an awesome job on his paint they didn't just give it one color they did a light plastic and then went over it with a nice wash um boots i like the feet feet are real unique i haven't seen anybody else have these feet yet um nice blue wash on the, the black boots let me get this off because I don't want that anyway. Nice orange color like the, the Origins version with a, a black. No, it's a blue plastic with a black wash on it. The tail comes detached. You can turn it here. But uh, what do you call it? it? It won't come back out. I mean, if you pull hard enough, I'm sure. But it does have a little bit of flex to it. 
and stays in position. It's just it's 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 a nice thing to keep him keep him balanced. But it does curl up so you can get him to stand with it. I don't know if you could really it's so damn heavy. I don't think I think you got to just deal with it and use them as this kind of this um, improv stand for them. <clears throat> so let's ditch the helmet, which is nice. I mean, it's got, it's got nice detail. It's got a little bit of shiny and nah, not really. It's just a dull orange and a silvery uh, metal col color to the helmet. Nothing too special. You have to pull his head off to get his armor off. Put his head back on. Now he's starting to look like a uh, whiplash here, right guys? Um, <clears throat> and then we'll take a look at his this armor. Come on. But, so let's get into Whiplash closer. So you get the dark green chest armor, like the Origins or Vintage one that's the same as the tail with the lighter color on the arms. I like his, I like his face. His, this eye over here is pretty nice. Let me get up in there. Come on. I know you want to. There you go. So... As you're looking at them, the eye on the right is a better eye than the left. The left, they didn't do as good a job with the, with the, adding the, what, however they apply it. But you get only three teeth on this one, where there's, yeah, there's three teeth, it looks like, on the, the, the Origins version. But, we're going to bring the Origin, come on, buddy. There we go. So we're gonna bring in the Origins version here and put it do a side by side comparison. So this one personally, I think he has a smile on his face, but that's just me. So you get to look at both of them there. I'll bring the camera over. So you can see how the the staffs or the spears. <clears throat> staffs spears are similar they got the little things here and here even to that two there two there two points to the blade so you got double the the edge you got the light green skin light green skin with a darker chest orange and orange purplish black purplish black so Color-wise scheme, the only thing I don't see here is gauntlets on the on the wrists here, or wrist protectors, but they're pretty similar. But for 16 bucks, I figured I might as well get them uh, and throw them in there with the rest of the monsters. So, I'm Jason. This is War Journal Toys. And if I didn't mention it, I got it at Target for half price. Um, that's pretty much the only place I've seen them. I think you can, you could probably get this on Big Bad Toy Store, but I can't confirm. So, if you like my content, please like, share, subscribe. Uh, if you're new to this channel, I appreciate a, a like. Uh, if you do like my content, because it helps the algorithm, uh, whore out my channel more out there on the interwebs. Uh, but if you like my content, like, please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.